He did not steal any money. For those that are making this situation, I want to say that the APC should take their time. We are not doing politics yet. Campaigns have not started. Don't use sentiments to lie against somebody because you want political gains by abusing immediate past governor Ifani Okowa and also abusing the governor of Delta State alone. We say no to it. 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 He has he was invited by the ESCC when he was abroad. He came in, he did not run away like others. He drove himself to Putakot, reported. When they asked him the questions, it took him days to answer because what you did for eight years, you don't go to rush and answer them in one hour. It took him two days or more to sit down and write, you said I stole money. The money you gave to me, this is what I used it for. Can you clap for Governor Kowa, please? And he has answered all your questions. Can I shock you? He was asked to get. Did you hear that? So please, just carry those rumors. On Friday, the APC released a press release under a group sponsored by an aide to former deputy, speaker, former deputy senior president, Omar Gege, accusing Governor Okowa, our immediate past governor, of looting the state treasury and also accusing Governor Sheriff, our leader, that he has done nothing in Delta State. Is that true? No. Is that true? No. That is lie from the pit of hell. I tell you today, what Governor Sheriff is doing in Delta State is unprecedented and no governor has done it before. He met the state in the safer side and he's taking it higher to a better land. Clap for Governor Sheriff. Clap for our leader, Governor, immediate past Governor, Dr. Ifai Ato Okowa. If you want to clap, and I want to tell you a thing, if you don't value something, you cannot get it. That's right. If you can't value something, you can't attract it, you can't get it. As a man thinking, so easy. That is why they will keep contesting, they will keep failing, because they don't value the number one seat of Delta State. I want to call on all Deltans, women abroad today, they should rally around the governor of Delta State, Governor Sheriff Uberiwori, that is on a mission to stand safe is a better place than the way he met it. I want to appreciate uh, the Dr. Dr. Eva Yoko At this juncture, the primary aim of establishing, of coming on board of the Integrity Group is to ensure that we propagate more agenda to all Nuka counties of the other state and go beyond, go to the mountain, over the hills and everywhere. Having said so, let it be known today that go and check, like I said before, other governors are borrowing from numerous banks and even international banks. Today, the Sheriff Du Koto of Africa has said, no, I will manage just as we have so that I will not mortgage the future of Delta State. So that is what we are having in Delta State right now. He is the governor for all of us, not for only Delta North, Delta Central or South. He is doing his best to ensure we all feel the impact of leadership, of governance, as it concerns Delta State now and beyond. <laughs> Having said so, Please, today, a man, your brother, father to some of you, uncle to some, and, and his son, some of you here, we came here on this invitation. He is no other person than Dr. Donald. Mike Okudolo, can you clap for him, please? He is the one standing in the gap to receive on behalf of his principal, who is our brother, your brother, and a leader with a difference. Mm.
Sisi Papa Bomi, Anon Sabi Peterson. I call the sheriff, I call Sabi Peterson. Another challenge, another challenge, another challenge, another challenge, plenty, plenty challenge, another challenge, another challenge, another challenge, plenty, plenty challenge. Mama Bomi, I know Sabi Okudolo. Sisi Papa Bomi, I know Sabi Pitasi. I go to Jerry, I go Sabi Okudolo. I go Sabi Pitasi. Another challenge, challenge, another challenge, another challenge, another challenge. Let's see, let's see, challenge, another challenge, another challenge, another challenge. Let's see, let's see, challenge. If you see my mama, Osana, tell her, say, Osana, I don't get the problem, Osana, I did for Sheriff, Osana, if you see my mama, Osana, tell her, say, Osana, I did with Pita Sing, Osana, I don't get the problem, Osana, if you see my mama, Osana, tell her, say, Osana, tell her, say, Osana, tell her, say, Osana, we don't get the problem, Osana. Clap for yourself in this afternoon. Thank you, thank you. Now we we came here, we're on a mission. So we are here today for Dr. Jonah Peterson. Clap for you, clap for you, clap for you. So, this is where we are. It is time to give honor to who honor is due. I, some time ago, I took a lash at Ebo, who is the administrator of the cast out. That we are going around the state, not from the car. He said, Okay, wait. I charge him up. Like I told you, a lion cannot give birth to a goat. It's an, it's an error. So, in a few weeks, he told me he's met our leader, our patron to be, or our patron, our patron, Dr. Donald, and I gave the dates. That it should be Tuesday. And the man also accepted Tuesday. Can you clap for him, please? He is ready. And when I and he had us on the streets on the air talking about sheriff and good governance. He said he wants to key in into the more agenda mantra so that the cast out can be represented anywhere we go, anytime, anywhere. So please clap for him again, please. Now we're going to do two things today. We will be, I will be unveiling him as patron of the More Agenda movement. You are all ambassadors of Governor Sheriff. Yes. Governor Sheriff is the grand patron of this group. So meet in the College of Patrons and the body of the more agenda under the auspices of integrity, good supporting, good governance. The hour has come. Wabi Dorime, who is playing the bell for us? Long Dorime. Who is in it for us? So now, Dr. Donald Peterson, please step forward. Let us have to join us. The Ika South administrator will join us. Ika Notice will join us. The representative of Hanabi uh, Kodira uh, will join us. The EA Liga Matters will join us. The Nose Committee will join us. Let us all present this award of honor. We'll come out. We're coming out. For the drama, where is best? It's just nothing. Yeah, yeah. Sherry Brace, we don't go tired. Sherry Brace, 
We no go tired, Sherry Prince. We no go tired, we no go tired, we no go tired, Sherry Prince. We no go tired, Sherry Agenda. Integrity group. More agenda. More agenda. Tuesday, 12th day of November 2024. We, this noble family of Governor Bolori, the more agenda ambassadors. Imagine the Foundation Ambassadors, popularly known as Integrity Group, are here today to honor one of us, an ambassador of the World Agenda, a leader by excellence in incarnation, a man with a sweat, too much teeth. We come here to honor you today. A nation builder, an award of honor presented to, to, to Donald Peterson, Peter as of the Governor of the State of Entrepreneurship Development. By the Secretary of the State, the more agenda, my foundation ambassadors. We give you, you can see the logos three in one. The Holy Trinity, represented on earth here. We give you today, John Donald Darcy, Lord God the Father, Amen. the Son, Amen. and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Peace, 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 peace. Amen. Peace, peace, peace. 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 Peace, peace, pe
to Integrity Group. He has asked me to step in his big shoes and um, whatever I say now that is uh, not correct, I take responsibility for it. If I say anything that is good, he takes the glory. <laughs> Our uh, leader here said something that I want to respond to. He said, the more agenda is a way of life. I want to add something else to it. This is integrity group. There's something I learned from my father as integrity. And what he taught us is that integrity is a way of life. So as members of the integrity group, eh, integrity is a way of life. Incidentally, in the years I've known my boss, my principal, Dr. Donald Odebe Peterson, he is a man that keeps his word. He does not only keep his word, he goes beyond your expectation in keeping his word. If you're expecting him to take a step with you, he takes two. And that is why I call him the doing of good doings. He's a man of good doing. He's a of good doing. And I must add that he's learned so much from our father, the immediate past governor, Dr. Ifain Okoko. And he's learning more from our present leader, Elder Sherry Okoko. I want to be asked that I should appreciate you all for this honor that has been done to him. You have honored him as a nation builder. You have also made him a patron of the integrity group. I want to say on his behalf, he will not let you down. He will not disappoint you. He will live up to the building and he will live up to expectation. He is somebody that is known to draw, draw the youth. He's an inspiration to the youth in Delta State. He's an inspiration to the youth in the car land. He has done so much. I'm not sure there's anybody in the car land who has not heard of Dr. Donald Peterson. Not head of him in the negative, but more in the positive. Yes, sir. He's a man that inspires all of us. He is a man that he calls those who work with him as my dear brother. I don't I, I, you know, I'm living testimony. You're a living testimony. You know, and he is somebody that respects, gives everyone his due respect yes. that makes you feel good with yourself. Yes. All right, yes. and he's a leader that I'm sure, first, if Jesus tarries, will, uh, will align and identify with him. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. If Sherry is to tell people Sherry did the work, a good work. And he has been doing the work, a good work. And they never reach two years. You see, they do good work. By the time when you go reach four years, Sherry don't change the narrative of politics. Yes. No, the narrative of politics. So that they can do that, they do the land. Yeah. No, I lie, people. Do the lie. I know I like to now, I'm not going to do politics like me. I know I don't like. But Sherry, show say, what you do? If you campaign for me, I will do what you want. And you will share with your eye. I think we are gradually coming to the end of our program. As you can hear, our leader of uh, Whisper, but we are moving to the next item. Unity Group. This is the one-year anniversary we did in Gov Unity of the day we unveiled the governor as the grand president of the, of the of the group. We launched this. Another edition is coming. I know you are supposed to play a key role in it. So the designer of the bulletin is the one standing in your front there, uh, Peter uh, Peter Okeleke. So this is it. Please hand over to him on our behalf. I'm giving him two copies. Come really one for you and one for him. Let me share them. So that you can you cannot share with him. So I tell him I've shared him of credit officially. God bless you. Thank you very much.
Getting the more agenda of the Borobori in the Nuka Kranis of Delta State. And that's what we represent. That's the logo. This is who we are. We are propagating the good governance of the Borobori. So, you are, what's the purpose of the gathering here in Angkor right now? Okay, it tells you we are all over the 25 edges of Delta and the words in Delta State. And we are here today to unveil the worthy apostle of the more agenda, a man with a difference, decency, and hard work, and support of humanity. We came to unveil Dr. Donald Onyibi Itasi as a patron of the group, making him a co-patron with the governor, because the governor is a grand patron of the group. And gathering here today to tell Ika people, Ika some people, that here we mean business and carry them along for the more agenda and we well inform and support the good governance of Gorochere Borobori. And I also come here, came here to thank Peterson, the Dr. Donald Peterson, for hosting us and we are happy to be here. It's a good day and a bright day for Delta State and Ika South and Ika Nation. To group in the next one to two years. In the next one to two years, like I said earlier, the more agenda is not a way of life. Integrity group, integrity should be a way of life for all of us. And in the next one to two years, every street in Delta State, integrity group will be there propagating the more agenda. And the patrons like Dr. Peter Sin Donan, Oyibe, who is a patron, will all grow together to ensure Delta State is shining in the League of Other States. An integrity group will be at the forefront propagating the good leadership of the Sheriff and even beyond to the federal constituencies, assembly members, and what of you are working with all of them. So integrity group will be 
all over the streets of Delta, shouting and mobilizing people to support the governor for four plus four for the continent. And any other good leader that we have, we bring them on board to lead along with the governor. That's what we will be. And that's the target. And what's your message for Delta people? My message to Delta is this. Governor Sherry Moise of our time, stand with him, support him to take us to greater heights. And we also appreciate our father, immediate past governor, Senator Dr. Tifani Okowa, for bringing us Sheriff and for doing what he did for Deltas. We also appreciate him. We are standing with Governor Sheriff, we are standing with Senator Dr. Tifani Okowa. At these also trying times, the siege is over, the house is peaceful, support the more agenda that we can have a state like never before in terms of the local dividend. That's my advice to Deltas. Together we can, together we move. God bless you all. Uh, Ma, please tell us your name. My name is Honorable Patricia Asiai, Chairman Agency for Adults and Non-Formal Education Works, and Vice Woman Leader Integrity Group Delta South. We are here in Ika, Agobi, to meet with our patron. He has done well. Is a very nice man. We are here to tell him the good works that our governor, Elder Sheriff Oboriwori, is doing for us. And our what we are preaching is nothing than everybody should go down to their world, down to the grassroots, to talk about our governor. He's a good man. No matter what, all the names, all the allegations, all the talked about him, they are is proving them wrong. He's working, and everybody is saying. Uh, there is a say that says, if when a good man rules, he said the people rejoice, and Delta states we are rejoicing for having sheriff as our governor. Integrity group, head by or uh, led by Dr. Edawene Oke. This group is going higher and higher. We are into the 25 local governments, preaching the good work of our dear government. We want everybody to emulate integrity group and work out PDP 4 plus 4. We have come to honor him to be part of us. He's a patron. He's our father. Is our leader. We have seen him as our father in this Ika South, in the Ika North. When we come to Ika to preach the gospel, the good news of PDP, we know we have a father here that we can rely on. He has shown us a leadership. He is indeed a leader. And we are grateful to have him as our patron in Integrity Group, Ika. Uh, the purpose of integrity group, what we are doing today, we just want everybody to relax. The message is Ukodo Master. This Ukodo Master is ready to give out this Ukodo, to serve out Ukodo to everybody. This is just the first year of our dear governor. He has done much this year, and I know the coming year he will do more than what he did this year. I say relax. The Ukodo will reach you. Wherever you are, the Ukodo will reach you. But I want to tell them that something. Before you eat the Ukodo, you must preach the Ukodo. People must say yes. They will point you that, I ah, see this person, he has really worked. So let us work. Together we can. And together we move integrity group forward. Honorable Isaac from South I'm the Vice Chairman Delta South Integrity Group and Treasurer of the Integrity Group doing here in Idaho. Today, the Integrity Group came to Ika South to inaugurate our patron of Integrity Group from Ika South. Doctor Donald Dutasi 
as the patron of Tegutubi Delta State. Is uh, Victor Singh singled out for this honor? Uh, because he received the, the patronship. He said the nation builder. With his little resources, he can be able to reach down to the grassroots, assist people, both women, men, youth, guests of the Ikasa. So he can reach far and near with the little resources they have. So he's a very nice man. And the integrity group to Delta. The integrity group, thank you. The message. The integrity group has the word it applies. It's doing what is right. When nobody is there. That's his integrity group. And we we know that Sheriff is doing what is right. When nobody is monitoring him. It's just like a small child that go to the university, leaving the father at the first time, leaving the parents at the first time. He go there, he don't have parents, but he will re he respect himself or respect himself. He will not do anything that is evil. That's his eternity. So Sheriff, when he come in, is doing what is good, what is right, making sure that all the leak and corner of Delta State, Sheriff is touching every day. When you go to worry, you see the flyover. Sheriff is the first governor in Delta State that brings Julius Beggar to come and do job. That means doing something which is right. Sheriff have changed the narrative of because when we start to campaign, they'll say, hey, we we'll campaign for you, they do. But Sheriff have tried to tell them, no, when you campaign, tell me what I want to do. And Sheriff will do it. And Sheriff is doing to do. All the corner is doing job. All the local government is doing job. Every area, empower people, do everything possible to make sure that Deltas got the what they want. As that is what they want. In town, a new journey bringing new things into changing the narrative of the political system.